What's up guys, XMarkJX here bringing you Healing Storm and Stockades on my alt character Rejuvenation and Holy Paladin and I am currently trying to level. So starting the video off when I was farming for the Titanium Seal of Dalaran on my Twink. Uh, Eternal Rain, a top notch rating guild, got a realm first achievement for killing one of the bosses in Old War without help, any help. So that's pretty awesome. I never come across that in in-game before so I thought I'd share it with you. Okay, so starting the actual instance here. We have a pretty well-rounded group. I tried to spec into uh, intellect over spell power, uh, especially at a low level because that way I could throw more heals out back and forth so it's pretty awesome. You see I go a little bit overboard with it and I just heal anybody any chance that I have to heal them. So that's really like, that's pretty good healing in my opinion, but whatever. So yeah, basically if you want to level a holy paladin you want to do a lot more instances than you spend time in questing because uh, basically what I do is I just log off for, for a few days and then I want to have all that rested experience I log back in do a crap load of instances and I hit a bunch of levels so that's my method of leveling holy paladins but uh, if you don't want to wait for that like cause I'm cool cause I have four other characters so if you don't want to wait for that then just spec him ret, spec him or her ret, and then just start questing. It's pretty easy to level that way. So yeah, uh, if you guys want to try to pay attention to the chat log in game, it's pretty funny. Since I'm not in the action, I'm just sitting back healing. Uh, I talk to Urkel the whole time, and uh, some of our responses back to each other are pretty funny. So if you guys check them out, um, yeah. So that's pretty much all I have to say about that. Uh, I've been trying to get my Twink maxed out at the moment. Uh, my Twink, I got his Herbalism to 225 finally last night. I had to escort through Stranglethorn Vale because all the herbs over there, uh, the mobs are protecting them. They're really high level and I can't handle them on my Twink. So I had to have an escort. Um, Urkel was, uh, was cool enough to get on, hop on his Death Knight and help me uh, escort, and escort me. Of course, I had to help out his twink with something. It was kind of like an exchange, I guess. But other than that, it took forever. Like, really, we were just finding all the herbs, waiting for down all the mob that died a couple times. It was just chaos. But finally, I got my lifeblood, rank 3, so it's awesome. 720 health over 5 seconds, averages like 143, 144 health a second. Big difference to my 480 health over 5 second lifeblood, rank 2. So, it's going to help me a lot in more Goals, especially since I only have 1,000 health. 720, that's a pretty big majority of my health, so that's going to help a grip. I hope to bring some um, uh, more Song Gulch and Arena videos in the future. Now that my Twink's way, way better geared, I got him some new shoulders and I got him some other stuff, which I will talk about later. I'm currently trying to raise my cooking on him for the well fed buff for War Song Gulch. It's 115, I need to get to 150. Not that hard, I'm probably going to do that later today. But uh, other than that, what I want to tell you is that I am leveling Eternal Rain. Well, I'm going to put all my focus into leveling him once I get my Twink. Uh, pretty good. I still need to get the two the two trinkets on my Twink. The Insignia of Alliance and uh, the Arena Grandmaster Trinket. I don't have anybody to help me with at the moment. And I need to get the Lucky Fishing Hat, which I don't know how long that's going to that's take me. But other than that, once I get that done, uh, I'm going to level Eternal Rain to 80. I'm going to try to. So once I get him to 80, I'm going to get him some decent gear, and then I'm going to respec him prot, so I can show you guys some serious power leveling. I like power leveling uh, paladins with paladins a lot more than I do with warriors, because they have the bubble, they have a self-heal, and it's a lot cooler. Like with Tanner's guy, he's specced into like, every time he blocks it does damage, I don't know why, but, or, uh, Shade the Dark Sky. Yeah, Shade the Dark. And I don't know why he's expecting that, but he doesn't want to really change it. It's, yeah, so it's like whatever. I'm just gonna level my paladin up. Pretty awesome. So yeah, pretty cool. We're almost ending the stockades here. It took like 25 minutes. I shrunk it down to like three minutes. Well, part of it, and then the last room, I just showed you guys the majority of it uh, in regular motion. So yeah, I got some two trinkets on my twink. Two temporary trinkets, both engineering. Uh, showing you guys here uh, that I got them from rare from vendors but it's a rare spawn and they only have one of them it's limited supply so I was lucky enough to encounter them on my first uh, go so it's pretty awesome I, I went to there's two vendors that sells each recipe I went to the one that was going to be most likely uh, less visited 
so that's pretty cool. And I'm showing you guys them here. Uh, one of them heals me, and but only has 10 charges, and the other one uh, isn't really useful, but it's good to have just because I have all my slots filled out. So that's pretty cool, in my opinion. So yeah, other than that, I had a, I started a new character called Shadow because I had two BOA gears that I wasn't using in my Twink, the one each sword and the shoulders. So he's like the beastiest level one on the planet. So it's pretty awesome. Showing you guys him here, showing you his gear. He's like, wow, beastiest level one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, coming out with another video, uh, hopefully tomorrow. And shut up, bird. <laughs> and I uh, hope to come out with more videos in the future. If you haven't subscribed yet, just hit that yellow subscribe button. And so yeah, till till next time, guys. Peace out. Woo.